it's really tough to lose games late eighth and ninth inning on balls that uh, should not be hit. And this is John Tamargo, InsideBaseball.com, and I'm going to show you how to prevent some of that. What we have here is a situation in the ninth inning where you have the time run or the winning run at the plate. And what you've got to concentrate on is not giving up that run. What happens a lot of times in this situation is we want to try to pitch inside all the time. What happens when you pitch inside is bad things happen. And just for an example, we can get ourselves in here. Now if you throw a ball and you want to come inside, boom, you, you nick him, run around first base with nobody out. That means the winning run is at first base. If not, you've got some guy that's a power hitter and you throw a ball inside that you don't get far enough in and boom, he hits the ball to that part of the ballpark. What we want to try to do as a catcher and even a pitcher is try to get yourself in the situation where if you're going to get beat with a pitch, it's going to be to the big side of the ballpark, meaning center field the other way. Most of the power for big power hitters is pull power. What we want to try to do is get them to hit the ball over here. Again, remember that if you pitch inside late in the game, bad things happen. You can miss, you nick a hitter, now they bunt, get a runner at second base, base hit beats you. What you want to try to do is, is make sure that you're trying to get them to hit the ball to the center of the field or that way and play your defense the same way. So that's one of the reasons that you guys get beat late in the game is trying to pitch inside on, on balls, which we don't need to. Let's make them execute, try to drive the ball the other way and play your outfield that way. So remember, anything inside, anything inside off the plate, you can get in trouble. And if you do come inside, and you don't get in far enough, you're gonna give up a home run. Remember, the younger you are, the less, the less you have an idea of where you're going. Big league pitchers may be able to do that. What we gotta concentrate on is the outside part of the plate and down, make sure that they hit the ball to the middle of the field and try not to get beat on balls inside, especially left-handers. They like to pull that ball, they got that little loopy swing, so try to keep the ball away and force them to hit the ball somewhere where they don't like to hit the ball. And that's one of the, one of the things that you have to remember as a catcher, and if you want to call a game and be successful at it, you have to learn the game and learn your hitters. I'm John Tamargo, Inside Baseball, and that's your tip for today.